Statistics basic settings and actions. So we'll start in the statistics application and the first thing we generally do is tap on edit clear all. This does quite a lot, not just clear any existing numbers out of the lists that are here, but also resets a lot of the graph uh, settings and calculation settings. So it's always worth doing. We'll tap OK to confirm. Now, um, at the moment, we've got three columns displayed. If I tap onto this icon here, I can change to four. Or you can see there's a little two there. If I tap it again, we go back to two and cycle back to three. So you can choose how many columns would suit the work that you're doing. Uh, a couple of settings at the bottom of the screen we should pay attention to. Now, these reflect the settings that were in the main part of the calculator. Uh, but the one we're really interested in is auto here. If you don't have auto, then just tap up to this little diamond. We're going to tap onto that. And there's only one setting here, and that is you can turn the stat window auto to on or off. And we always want to make sure that it's on, so I'll tap on just to keep it on. That'll make sure that any graph we draw gets automatically scaled without us having to interfere. Uh, next, let's type a few numbers into the list here. So I'll put in one, two, three, five, and six, and then uh, we'll look at a few editing tools. So first off, if um, suppose this six was meant to be an eight, all we simply do is tap on the cell, tap in the correct number, press execute, and it's corrected. So that's a very quick way to uh, correct an individual entry. If we decided we actually had wanted um, the number four in between the three and the five here, then tap onto the, I want to insert between the three and the five. So tap onto the lower number and under edit, there's insert cell. And this will insert undefined. You can see at the bottom on the entry bar here, uh, undefined. Now we want it to be four. So we'll just tap on four, press execute, and we've inserted a number. Um, to delete a number, so say we changed our mind about the four, there is a couple of ways, edit, delete, cell and it's disappeared or we could simply choose the clear button over here if I tap on clear once uh, the number disappears and we're left with the next one